Hey guys, Hall of Fame Collector here. It's January, uh, I think it's the 9th or the 10th. Um, already lost track. Um, I'm going to switch things up for now. Um, I was accumulating a whole bunch of items and then shooting a pretty decently long video, shoving all my cards in there. This time I'm just going to keep it to like uh, four, five, six cards. Maybe a weekly short thing. That way it's just a one, two, three video, in and out, on to the next one. Um, we'll see how that goes. All right, starting off, tackling my list as usual for 2018. Um, I'm going to start off here. I have a total of six cards to show. Actually, one, two, three, four, five, seven cards to show you. Um, <clears throat> first two are basketball. Um, I'll start off here. Um, both are actually coaches, and both are actually very hard to get. I won't say very, very hard, but on the hard end to get um, on a sports card, on card. So first one here is Hall of Famer Chuck Daly. Again, one of the best coaches of all time. And uh, not an easy one for an on-card, um, which is, of course, what I prioritize. Um, it's a necessity for baseball, but uh, I'm prioritizing it for basketball at this moment. Second guy, I got another legendary coach, John Wooden. Wooden, Wooden. Um, so, yeah, two really, really, really good coach pickups. Um, happy to get them. All right. Basketball side on to baseball. Um, <clears throat> 2001 Fleer Greats of the Game. Another uh, one of the most iconic sets in my mind um, uh, to, to collect. Uh, lots of Hall of Famers, 57 of them uh, at my count. And again, trying to get everybody. Uh, I managed to get two more. Uh, all right. So we have Hall of Famer. Frank Robinson, and these cards are, again, uh, pretty plain Jane, but actually in person, the background, it's a sparkle, um, which actually looks really nice um, in person. Um, and the second one is Ryan Sandberg. So, good to get those two. Um, and I will try to pursue more as the year progresses. Next is for my on-card Hall of Famers. I am missing six at the moment. I can now, I, was it six? Six or eight. I can now cross another one off the list. Um, and that is 2,000. Greats of the game, Lou Boudreau. Um, he's actually a little on the harder side to get an on card. Um, there's some cheaper stuff out there, but uh, I wanted to stick with Fleer Greats of the game since uh, it's just a really good set. Um, I might actually go after 2000 Fleer Greats of the game, another really good set. Um, lots of SPs, of course, but that wasn't cheap. Um, it surprised me how much he goes for. And second, just because there was a lot of the listings um, going on and I wanted to take advantage of combined shipping, I didn't have the guy. And to me, he's either a Hall of Very Good or a future Hall of Famer. And that's Jim Cott. Um, really, really cheap. So took advantage of the, free, of the uh, combined shipping and picked him up on card. All right, and last but not least, uh, the next card I have here, and the last one for this super quick video, is actually something that I didn't need for any collection, but when it popped up uh, as a buy it now or best offer, I thought it was already a really good deal. I put a best offer in, assuming it might even just get sold or, or at, the, at the asking price, but for whatever reason, two hours go by and he accepts my offer, so I thought I got a really, really good deal. Um, on this, uh, and that is 2017 um, Dynasty on card, Mike Piazza, number to five, and uh, the patch is just awesome. Awesome patch, and of course these Dynasty cards are sealed, so it's a, you know obviously a real patch. You don't have to worry about that. Um, just a really nice card, uh, nice jumbo patch from the Mets. Um, and 
you know, good to go after these things now. I just, I like things neat. All of my cards I, I put in magnetics and brand new magnetics, that is. And uh, I use the, um, the True Fit, I think it's called True Fit, uh, the sleeves, um, which work out great. So it's nice to have, you know, a nice new magnetic. Obviously, these, these come from Topps Magnetics uh, in the magnetic, but uh, <clears throat> obviously, you know, I'm sure some are mishandled. So you get some of these things second or third owner, and I'm sure the cases are all scratched up and whatnot. It's nice to get something new, but um, really, really nice patch and couldn't pass it up. So there you go. Those are my uh, pickups thus far. And um, as time progresses, I'll be shooting more vids. All right, guys. Take care.